all right what's up with the youtube fam and i'm back again with another video so listen man the title of this video says that she went to a married man's house and demanded he came outside now i ain't gonna lie to y'all it sound like this is a side piece scorned or something like this somebody being weird as hell that i already knew they place and still didn't know how to act when it came down to it you know what i'm saying that shit crazy boy stop committing to stuff well, first of all, I'm not advocating for you to go out there and do nothing that you shouldn't be doing. But if you choose to do whatever you want to do with your life and it consists of things like this, man, you got to know your role, man. You got to play your part. But it is what it is. Let's go ahead and get into this and see what the hell is going on. And like I said before, I'm not advocating for it. But if you choose to do this type of shit with your life, man, you got to know who you're dealing with. And you got to know your role. If you're going to be the one that's going to be you know dealing with somebody that's in a relationship but other than that let's get into it y'all hit the like button for me if you're rocking with the channel and uh yeah man make sure i add on my social medias and everything that's gonna be in the comment section also and uh yeah man that's all i gotta say let's go ahead and get into it see what the hell going on with the side piece man <laughs> uh, who who are you barbara this really? shirley who are you oh uh, i'm a friend of congress <laughs> well i know all of his friends and i don't know you mm. Mm. So why are you at my house? And how do you have my address? Stalking. You can tell him it's crazy. Hey, so? I'm sorry, I can't hear you. I said your name is what? What's your name? Damn, Thomas. I took the name. I know, this, 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 this is his wife. Ooh, the maid. Why? Uh, yeah, this is his wife. And why? Do you oh, have my address? Address. And why do you have my address? I'm sorry. Why do you have my address? She who you here? Well, we're friends, okay, and he didn't mention anything about a wife. Well, he does have a wife. <laughs> <laughs> She's so player. <laughs> so I'm trying to figure out Ooh, what she type of friend me. are you. Well, I know what type of friend she is. The one that's eating them alive on the side. She would have turned my boy ass up, putting that big old cat on him. You see her, her, she got, she done got discombobulated. You know what I'm saying? To the point where she had to come over there and find him or come over to where he's at. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like that. She probably knew he had a wife. But I did see her bag her head back like, what the fuck? You know, so we really just don't know. But my boy Thomas, you got to put that thing down somewhere, boy. You can't be putting that cat up in everybody else because they be acting crazy these days, man. Well, they always have. But you're popping up at people's houses and shit like that is so lame. And I feel like people need to go to jail for that. That's how much I hate that. That shit weird, bro. Let's get back to it, though. Call him right now. Call him. Believe me, call him, because believe me. Mm -hmm. She about to. He's going to get the business from me. Oh, we he going to get a whooping. <laughs> he better not answer. Because he ain't answer for her. Why are you calling him? Why are you, first of all, why do you even have his number? You said you're a friend, but I don't know, and I know all his friends. Look at her. She done, she, she done blacked out. She ain't trying to hear nothing. Oh, he know better not to answer. <laughs> he probably see on the well, camera. Is, can you please tell him to come to the door? No. No, I cannot tell him anything. What you can do is get away from my door. Um, Facts. Before I call 911 and say I got a trespass <laughs> at my door. I got you. I got you. Yeah, you do your thing, girl. Get away from this door. Oh doing? shit! Oh look now, look. So I done downloaded some on my phone. I started that shit. So what they say? I know you're lying. Okay then. I guess it's gonna be a compilation video. Oh these other bit. Damn, my ass didn't put all my videos together into this one right here. Let's fuck it. It is what it is. Let's get back into rewind just a little bit. I done downloaded this and then add the other shit in here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's what we doing? You just got my number upstairs. And now you put a whole nother thing. Hey, this is my girlfriend. That's your girlfriend. That's the man. Shit, Baby, I don't even know this one. He just said, he just sent my number upstairs. <laughs> he just sent my number upstairs. Yeah, check his phone. Okay. Say, cuz, so you were drinking? Say, cuz, you were drinking? Boy, that nigga the hell, boy. <laughs> Hey, this nigga here, boy. He got me crying, bro. Cuz, you been drinking? He said, I just asked him what time it was. 
Woo, boy, hell no, nah, boy. Let's go. Damn. <laughs> Do y'all think this is hating or she looking out for the woman? Let me know your honest opinion. Let's get back into it, though. So so I can see. This is the outside of the bamboo home. Okay. Upstairs, you see the balcony. There's an inside as well. I host a karaoke brunch every Sunday at the Bamboo Room in Lake Worth, Florida. So last week, taking a break, minding my business, yeah. sitting on the balcony, this dude came and approached me. He was like, oh, I love your vibe. I think you're beautiful. I would like to get to know you. Let's exchange numbers. I said, um, oh, we're not like giving out my number, but we can exchange social media. Yeah. He's like, nah, I don't want to be one of those dudes where I'm hitting you up in your DMs all the time. I want to have direct contact. And I was like, well, I really don't know you like that. So, you know, this dude actually started singing to me, can we talk? Yeah, he started oh, to sing it. And then hey. he died, so he decided to sing it to me on the balcony outside. We kikied. I thought it was cute for the moment. I was like, okay, whatever. We exchanged numbers, which I told you I was not giving up my number. Uh, me so, too. he asked me if I wanted to drink. I said... Now I'm good. Well, he went to the bartender and got me a drink anyway. The bartender came and got me a drink and said, the guy you were sitting out on the balcony with got you this drink. Okay, okay. Oh, I I my boy down I mean upstairs trying to start a whole nother family while his woman downstairs. But it's a different type of animal right there, boy. Let's get back into it. And back to what I did. And about twenty five minutes later I took another break. I wanted to come outside to say thank you. Yeah. So as I see them outside I try to approach him and I was like, hey, you know, I called his name, he's like, hey. And then I noticed like he was walking away from me, then he put his arm around his door. Now I'm not a cop blocker, because I I'm I damn sure ain't a cop blocker. Oh, really? But I was just like, well damn, you was going so hard, now you act like you don't know me. Like what's really good? Like I didn't have to give you my number. And he's like, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> and I was like, what do you mean you don't know what you're talking about? You were just going so hard up there on the balcony. But then he put his hands around this beauty right here. And I was just like, uh, oh, so that's what we're doing. So that's what y'all guys sing, but what y'all don't know is, look, I got his girl right here. I got his girl right here. What did you do that day? I cut him. Cut him loose. Because you went in his phone and what you seen? Made his phone number. <laughs> Everybody's like, why you didn't call him? Because I was recording. That's why I didn't call him at that point where everybody's like, well, you should have just called him. I couldn't have called him if I was recording. But after we, you know, I stopped the video, we looked at his phone, and guess what? She saw my number. So she cut him the fuck off. Okay, so now look, we hanging out just the following week, we hanging out, we exchange numbers, we talk, and we uplifting each other. That's what we do, and as females, I feel like we shouldn't be so passive when we know these dudes are doing wrong. Okay, so everybody ain't gonna try to bash and say, oh, she probably with her no. no. She's with me now. <laughs> And like we You're both like just we strictly did like, but I'm just saying, yeah. you know, but we we, we wanna start that's that's just what it is. You know what I'm saying? So I just wanna give y'all an update guys. See y'all go. Huh? Dang, so I think that it was really just the fact that well first of all he already cutting up. But on top of that, you lying and shit, people do not like no lie. Now, I know a lot of people always act like they want the truth and they can't take it. But at the same time, if you call red handed, just keep it 100, man. Somebody might have a little bit more respect for you than you just doing whatever you did. Because if you go into the extent of lying away, cuz was just lying. Are you drunk? Are you on drugs? I don't know you. I ain't seen you. Then he's so dumb. He done gave her the phone so she can actually look up the number. Man, he tripping, man. That nigga up there tripping, boy. I mean, 
just cut his ass off, man. I mean, people ain't gonna do all this for nothing now. But it is what it is. Y'all choose to do what the hell y'all want to do. Let's get back into it, though. Make sure y'all follow her. All right. Check out the bamboo one, though. Now you want to tell me you're not sleeping with my husband? Is that what you want to tell me right now? What? What? She said, what? You hear it, goddammit. Seriously, I'm saying, Lacey, you're sitting in my husband's car at 11 o'clock at night, so he's going to take you home? Okay. Okay, what? You know what I'm saying? I'm going to hear it because I can't wait. Here he comes. Look at his version of it, too. Yeah, she's not here, right? Yeah, she's not here, right, guy? Yeah. So now you want to tell me that this isn't happening? I can't wait to hear that this isn't happening. Oh, it's happening. <laughs> it's happening. <laughs> yeah, look at him for comfort, honey. Look at my husband for comfort. Why? Why? Why do you think this girl is called Last Call Lacey? Why do you think she's called that guy? Last. She sits. Hold on, let me see. Hold on, let's see, let's see, let's see. Two bars late at night with other people's husband and and pounces on them. Yeah. Is she pouncing on them or they know better? Now I believe she probably pouncing putting that cat on them now for sure and some good throat and stuff. But as far as her chasing them, I just don't think they. I think they they just they just know, and they gonna go ahead and get what they know. You know what I'm saying? She still out of line and wrong for it. You know what I'm saying? But they calling her last call, boy. Ooh wee. She must she must be a little hurt or something, you know, in the face. You can't really just see her right now because of the camera and stuff like that. But y'all already know, man, around twelve well, I, I mean back in the day. Well I'm I'm gonna put it like this. A lot of people know if you can't get none <laughs> that you really want around three, four o'clock, <laughs> shit like that, you start hitting up the little stragglers. And I guess she a straggler, but yeah, last call, Lacey, Lindsay, whatever the hell she is, man. She, I, I, I couldn't fuck with nobody like this. If you sitting around bars and everybody just boning you and stuff like that, I'm scared. There's too much fungus going on out here. And breath probably funky. All type of other shit that go with this. But I do want to know your thoughts and opinions on this. Do y'all feel like it's more so her looking for the men or the men know who it is? And it could be a mixture of both now. But overall, I just think that the dudes know who to go to when they're trying to get their rocks off at a certain point in time of the night. Let's get back into it, though. Right, you've left the trail, Lacey. So you're going to continue to lie to me that that girl's sitting in the front seat of the car. <laughs> He's going to lie to the end. Yeah. Yes, you have. She ain't here. I didn't say that all night. She ain't been here. That's not her car. It's exactly what you said. An hour and 20 minutes ago, when he said you had passed out the door and you were going home. Right. And that girl's car is sitting right there, and your car is sitting, what is it, right over there, and now it's here with her loaded up. How convenient. First try cheating as husband tricking another girl. You are so. You are so. What's your name? Who are you? Are you going to go make sure to have an Instagram? She's like, what the fuck? Yeah, I'm sending this to your mom right now. She didn't wipe come in at 5.20 a.m. Oh, I would have sent her right back out the door. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, I'm sending this to your mom right now. Yeah, I'm sending this to your mom right now. What the hell going on? She's sneaking in or what? We'll see that you two. She locked the door. Mm. Yep. She's drunk, hungover. And full of cum. Locking the door. Full of cum. Been fucking. Has not been seen in 24 hours. Ooh wee. Does not care about her children. Does not care about her husband. Openly cheats on his husband. But this is what the courts. Ah, uh, my boy. My boy getting his evidence. Right, still. Leave her for sure. That cat happens to be a better mother to those children than the biological mother. Damn. She ain't about shit then. Again, as you can see here, 
сумеем. No. Why? I have to pay child custody and I don't have to get to see my children. Damn. Go ahead. You do that. And this is the type of things that you're giving women the ability to do by taking advantage of the laws, taking advantage of their husbands and of their children. Go ahead. Because all that money that goes into the custody will go into their lifestyle and not the children. Dang, I hate that form. I'm done here. Dang, well, that's the end of that video, man. This right here was an emotional roller coaster, but it is what it is. I did say I was going to start bringing compilations. I didn't know that they was going to add the other video to it, but it is what it is. I do want to know your thoughts and opinions on this whole situation, man. Let me know your thoughts and opinions about The main thing I want to know about, well, I can't even say the main thing. But it is what it is. Just let me know your thoughts and opinions on everything, man. If you're out there cheating, popping cattle, swinging your meat, certain places, stuff like that, man, try to chill out, you know what I'm saying, as best as possible, you know, unless you got an understanding with your significant other. But other than that, man, you got these people out here, you know, running loops behind you and stuff like that. That ain't a good look, man, you know what I'm saying? So try to be as honest as you can. If they can't accept it, fuck them, you know. That's all I got to say. Let me know your thoughts and opinions, and I'll holler at y'all later on another video. Ah.